Hi everyone, my name is Courtney and this is your weight circuit workout. Today I have planned 12 exercises that we'll do two rounds of. We'll do 45 seconds of exercise and 15 seconds of rest. So I have my timer ready. The first exercise is going to be bicep curls. I'm going to use medium to heavy weights. Um, so grab whatever feels comfortable for you. So bicep curls, you're going to curl up to shoulders and back down. We're going to get started in three, two, and one. Curl it up, control it down. You want a slight bend in your knees. You don't want to be stick straight. You want to control the weights up, control the weights back down. Exhale, on the way up, inhale, relax back down. Exhale up, inhale back down. Nice and controlled, slow on the way down. Almost there, three, two, one, and rest. Next exercise is a squat. So feet a little wider than shoulder width. Weights are either in front or on the side. And you just squat down and back up. And here we go, down and up. Down and up. Keep that back nice and flat. All the weight going down and up through your heels. You want to make sure that your heels are firmly planted on the ground. Protect those knees. And you're just sitting back. You're shooting your, your butt back like you're sitting in a chair. A few more. Last three, two, and one. I'll get one more in. Okay. Next exercise, tricep kickbacks. I'm going to drop down to my tens, elbows up nice and high, and you press it back. Here we go, three, two, one. Your elbows don't move, so you're not swinging your elbows. On the way back, squeeze your triceps. Keep your abs pulled in nice and tight. Take it back. You want to control the weights. The weight back in. Press and squeeze. Last three, two, and one more. Good. Alternating. Reverse lunges. I'm going to go back up to my 15. So you're taking a big step back, bend the back knee down, and pop it forward. Let's go. Down and up. Down and up. Keep your shoulders pulled back. All your weight is going down and up through this front heel. You go at your own pace. Keep those abs pulled in. And if you can't bend your back knee all the way down, I like to try and kiss my knee, but you can reduce that bend. Next one, shoulder press. All right, I'm going to stick with my 15s. You can go both at the same time, or you can alternate. Three, two, one, let's go. Exhale, when you push up, inhale down. Good. The 
If you're using heavy weight, you can alternate one at a time. Or you can press both up at the same time. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Exhale. Good. All right. Next one is reverse deadlift. So flat back. You want to bend down and control it back up and squeeze your glutes. Here we go. Three, two, one. Down and back up. Keep the weights close to your body. And just go until you feel that pull in your hamstrings. Everyone's going to look a little different depending on how flexible, how tight your hamstrings are. Good. So you're hinging at your hips. Control it back up. Squeeze your glutes. Down. Pull it in. Down. Feel the pull. Squeeze it back up. Good. Finish there. Next one, rows. You're going to stick with 15s on this. Lean it forward. Pull your elbows straight back towards your ribcage. Here we go. Lift and down. Squeeze your shoulder blades. Pretend like there's a pencil between your shoulder blades. You want to squeeze it. Drive those elbows straight back. Protect that lower back by pulling in your abs. You can also stagger one leg if that feels better on your back. You just want to make sure you switch halfway because you are putting some weight on that leading leg. And next one, plie squats. So toes pointed out. You can rest the weights in between. You're going to pop straight down and back up. Three, two, one. Let's go. Down and up. Good. Knees follow the direction of the toes. So toes pointed out, knees pointed out. Get nice and low. Sit it down and pull it up. You want to squeeze your glutes together on the way up. Last 10 seconds. Three. Two, and one. Next one, lateral raise. Okay, I'm gonna take it back to my tens here. I'm gonna lift it straight out to your side and back down. Here we go. Lift and down. Exhale, inhale down. Exhale up, inhale down. Now, doing both at the same time is too hard. You can alternate one arm at a time if that's easier for you to do, especially if you're lifting a little bit heavier. Or you can do both at the same time. We're almost there. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Good job. Okay, lateral lunges. I'm going to stick with the tens for this one. We're going to take it out to the side, bend it down, and switch to the opposite. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Take it out. Drop the chest. Push off to the beginning. Drop your chest. Sit it back. Push to the beginning. Drop it down. Down, down. And back up. You're shooting those hips back. 
You can speed it up a little bit if you want. Down, lift. By adding movement and a little speed, get that heart rate up in that cardiac zone. Burning calories, building lean muscle at the same time. Almost there, three, two, and one. Woo, we get to lay it down. Chest press. I'm gonna grab my 15s. You're just gonna press it up and down. Here we go. Lift and back down. Exhale up, inhale down. Again, if you need to, you can do one at a time, one weight at a time, or you can do both. Good. Squeeze your chest muscles as you press it up. Control it down. Good work. And relax. And then the last one in this circuit, I'm going to drop one weight down. One weight right here on my hips. You're going to lift it up and back down. Okay, go ahead, lift and back down. Squeeze your glutes, relax. Up and lift, back down. Squeeze the butt together and back down. If you want, you can use both your weights. And keep your abs engaged. Give them a little squeeze. Just because we're squeezing the glutes, don't forget to squeeze your abs. Exhale up. Inhale down. And relax. We're back to the top, everyone. Bicep curls. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, lift and curl. Nice and controlled. Exhale, inhale, release it. Good, remember that slight bend in your knees. Palms face up for this bicep curl. A lot of bicep variations. 10 more seconds. Remember, keep those abs nice and tight. Three, two, and one. All right, we have squats. Feet a little wider than hip width apart. And again, weights can be either out at your side or in the middle. Here we go. Squat it down and lift. Down and lift. You want to sit back like you're sitting in a chair. All your weight going down and up through your heels. Good. You should be able to wiggle your toes. Then you know that weight is all going down and up through your heels. 15 seconds to go. Get nice and low. Seven. Keep squatting down nice and low. And relax. Okay, tricep kickback. Okay. I'm gonna lean it forward, remember. Elbows up high, kick it back. Here we go. Kick it back. Squeeze your triceps yeah. as you kick. Good. 
Remember, those elbows don't move. And with this one, if it's too heavy to go both at the same time, you can alternate. Remember that. Take it back. Three, two, and one more. Okay, alternating lunges, reverse lunges. Okay, I'm gonna go back to my 15s. Big step back. Remember, you don't have to go down as low. Here we go. Down and switch. You should feel your heart rate go up with this as well because of that movement. Your legs are strong muscles, large muscles in the legs. It's good to work these leg muscles. Very functional movements like squats, getting up and down from the chair, from your bed, from the couch. I'm sorry, I'm washing my feet. Keep that chin pulled up. And we're done. Next one, shoulder press. All right, I'm gonna stick with my 15s. You can go both at the same time, or you can alternate. Three, two, one, let's go. Exhale, when you push up, inhale down. Good. If you're using heavy weight, you can alternate one at a time. Or you can press both up at the same time. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Exhale. Good. All right, next one is reverse deadlift. So flat back, you wanna bend down and control it back up and squeeze your glutes. Here we go, three, two, one, down and back up. Keep the weights close to your body. And just go until you feel that pull of your hamstrings. Everyone's going to look a little different depending on how flexible, how tight their hamstrings are. Good. So you're hinging at your hips. Control it back up. Squeeze your glutes. Down. Pull it in. Down. Feel the pull. Squeeze it back up. Good. Finish there. Next one, rows. Okay. Lean it forward. Remember, pull up towards your rib cage. Here we go. Lift and down. Squeeze your shoulder blades. Control your breathing. Slow it down. Lift and squeeze. Think about squeezing those back muscles. Lift through the elbows. Pull the elbows back and control back down. Keep your abs pulled in nice and tight. Almost there. Five more seconds, couple more in. Excellent. Okay, plie squats. Remember, toes pointed out, knees track the toes. Squat it down low, lift it back up. Down and up. Sit down nice and low. Good. Knees point out, toes point out. 
Keep those abs engaged. More than halfway there. Set it down low. Squeeze those glutes on the way up. And if two weights are too much, you can always just use one. Down and up. Three, two, and one. Lateral raise. I'm gonna drop it down to my ten. You wanna pick the weight that you can do the best form. Lift it up and down. Exhale, inhale. Remember, you can do one arm at a time, or you can do both. Just up to shoulder height and back down. Exhale, up and inhale down. Good. This is working the side part of your shoulders. Almost there. Oh, one more. Okay, lateral lunges. I'll stick with my tens. I'm gonna probably add a little speed to it. Again, you can go slow and maybe a little heavier weight. Here we go. Take it out to your side. Hips go back, push off. Switch, down and push. Sit it back, chest forward. Chest forward, back flat. And I take the weights and go in between my knee. You can keep it on the inside if you want. You'll feel that heart rate driving up. We're almost there. Three, two, and one. Lay down down for chest press. I'm gonna grab my 20s for chest press. Here we go, press it up. Exhale down. Up and down. Squeeze your chest and relax. Up and down. Have the weights go right over your chest and back down. Exhale, push it up. Inhale, relax down. I can't see the timer, so whenever it beats, that's when we're done. There we go. And we can use either both weights or just drop one weight down for that last exercise, the glute bridge. And you're gonna drive through your heels to lift up. Here we go. Lift and down. Squeeze your glutes. Last exercise, really push yourself, lift and squeeze. Lift up nice and high, squeeze, squeeze. When it beeps, I want you to hold it up and pulse. We're gonna finish it off. There's that beep, pulse. Lift it up and pulse. Just 15 seconds of pulsing. And relax. I threw that last one in there. Great job, everyone. Thank you everyone for joining me for that weight circuit workout. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you at the next one.
Bye.